What can entrepreneurs do differently or think about differently in the business pitches? Like 2% of the new businesses that get formed succeed. It's like 2% of the pitches that you hear end up being real pitches. And what I mean by real pitches is that there's credibility behind the people. The concept is in a market where there's opportunity, the barriers to entry are where you want to have them. The legislative and regulatory environment is there. The cap stack looks right. They've identified something that was a big market segment. They address that market segment. I mean, these are critical things that a pitch has to have. I'd like to see more depth of knowledge of the business, more depth of experience from the person pitching. I want to see much better communication skills. Scott, If we can change one thing in the world, it would be to teach everybody how to speak publicly, how to address people, how to communicate. 98% or 99% of the pitches are just Hail Marys from people who are not prepared. They don't have the background. They look back at the past 12 years and see how frothy things were and the availability of capital and social media. Oh, I'm just going to pitch someone. You can tell very, very quickly if it's going to be a good fit, if it's right, if it's going to be a high probability of success and maybe you want to invest in it. Very quickly, we can tell.